This little device here is a masterpiece of neuroengineering. Scientists have designed this technology in such a way that it can restore the sense of normal human hearing. But we need to remember one thing. This one is not a cure for hearing loss. This is just a tool. Most of the patients, they focus on which implant brand to use or what is the software programming behind it. But they need to remember that even the most advanced software in the world cannot function properly if the interface with the brain is being compromised and that interface is being dealt by us it's our responsibility as a surgeon to ensure that the interface is perfect now let me tell you how the interface with the brain is being met as a surgeon by myself now we are inside the skills lab or the temporal bone lab and this is the 3d printed human ear bone Inside this is a tiny cochlea, which is 2.8 centimeters in size. Now my job is to insert this flexible electrode array, which is designed by our scientists very carefully into the cochlea. Let me show you how. If you look at it, this is how stable my hands are. There is literally no tremor, nothing. And the electrode very clearly, without any resistance, it has to go in and this is how an ideal insertion should be now if you looked at the insertion technique what I used there were no tremors in my hands and this delicate electrode array was very beautifully threaded into the cochlea now watch the tip of the electrode if the surgeon has a tremor that micro movement acts like a saw against delicate membranes and this we call it as trauma and this results in inflammation which leads to loss of spiral ganglion cells loss of residual hearing and this is catastrophic if the angle is wrong or the force is too high the electrode just buckles it kinks uh, now look at this this kink breaks the internal wires it compromises the signal once this happens inside the patient the outcome is gone as there is a physical damage which has happened. They'll see high impedance and they'll see dead channels and no amount of software tuning can fix a hardware installation failure. So the technology is perfect. The programming is advanced and the surgery, the surgery is the foundation. Dr. Rao's ENT Research Center, we trained more than hundreds of surgeons here at this particular skills lab. So while choosing a surgeon, ensure that the surgeon has very good command over the anatomy and a surgeon should have the capacity to navigate any kind of a complex surgical anatomy and provide the best possible hearing outcomes for your patient. So while choosing an implant, choose expertise, choose precision, choose the best cochlear implant surgeon available at your area. If you have any questions regarding cochlear implant about the hearing technologies, please comment in the comment section below. I'll answer as soon as I can. Thank you. Namaste.